There's been a murder! Who's dead? Who did it? The Roaring Mountains. When was this game made? I want to say 2004. Four? I don't know. I'm, I'm, that's a good guess, to be honest. Good guess. Good old days. Look at this. Look at the quality of this boat. It's HD right there. Look at that. The boat is in HD. But the rest of the screen... <laughs> <laughs> there's like... Certain parts of the screen is in HD. There's the eagle. Oh! oh, oh. She trusts you? Yes. Yes. Perhaps you can get me a drink from the bar downstairs. Of course, love. Let's go to the bar. Let's go. <laughs> so I can ask her any questions. <laughs> what do we need to ask her? Is anyone even dead? No, no, no one's so, dead. We're not questioning people before somebody's died. <laughs> <laughs> we're not, this is not it. Who did it? Where were you at the time? Well, it's just like it's 20 minutes when someone just died. Ask why you're even there? Yeah. Oh. She's on a boat to over the world, should she be? She, she is on coke. <laughs> look, look at her eyes. <laughs> She's on cocaine. Look at this broad. You! Why is she why is she not working? <laughs> Isn't she a maid? <laughs> you! Sweep the floor! <laughs> She's uh, the what do they call them? The help. The help. The help. The help looks like she needs help. Look at that. She looks dead. She's frail. Yeah, I guess. Look, a clue. What is it? Oh, wait, 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 wait. This picture doesn't seem very useful. That's not for you to say. Let's have a look at this gramophone. Ah, oh, just fuck off. We have to get a uh, red dress, a drink. <laughs> so she asked for from the bar down there. Ooh, look. And turn around, that's a murder weapon! <laughs> we found the murder weapon! Uh, uh, I guess I'll have to go in. Uh, I think that'll be <clears throat> That's great. I knew I shouldn't have came on this cruise. Oh! Oh, it's the last arrival. You nearly missed this boat. What? I was always on the boat, actually. Lady. Go. Talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh look, a man smoking the pipe. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> yes. Beautiful. I shouldn't bother her now. It might disrupt her rhythm. She looks, looks like it. that actress. Who? Is it Kate Blanchett? Oh. Lady Galadriel! <laughs> Sabata. Guest Ian Maskey. Mask. Mask. Oh, mask. Mask or mosque. Maybe it's a Muslim clue. Alright. <laughs> turn this off. Alright, close. Close! Turn this off. Get away from this little vegetable. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Here we go. Hitler's uncle. <laughs> <laughs> the Count Dracula having a drink. Ah, you must be the investigator. Well, I uh, yes. Buzzing about. Yes. I did my share of investigating for the military, you know. Yeah. The Rhineland. Drink. Click on the drink. You click on the uh, the word. Can I have a drink? This bell end is just drunk from the glass. Oh, he's giving me another one. There's two glasses here, bro. I just have one of these. <laughs> just give me the bottle. Don't give me that one. Alright, I guess. All right. Is this mustard? Yeah. Gay. Look how gay that man is. 
No one smokes a pipe like that. So what a gay way to smoke a pipe. <laughs> <laughs> Not that there's anything wrong with being gay. It's just an observation. Isn't that right, Daniel? <clears throat> yes. <laughs> you're going to blur that out. You're going to cut that out when I say, edit this out, future Daniel. And this as well. <laughs> there we go. Bypass the old bag and the cat head. In we go. What are these two doing hanging about on the halls? Maybe there's a romance in the air. This taken me fucking 10 minutes to go get this bitch a drink. Let's go this way. Hey, woman. <laughs> Yo. Oh, okay. Yo, woman. Yeah. Drink it. Thank you. Jesus. We shouldn't stay here and talk anymore. People are watching us. You just took one sip of the drink and dropped it? <laughs> I have to speak to a Nazi and a vegetable to get you that drink. Stupid bitch. <laughs> I'm going to go talk to someone else. Leave me alone. When is someone gonna die? There we go. What's up, buddy? Go look at ominous. Enjoying our little cruise. There has to be a better way to welcome the new year. This guy is up to something. It's, what day is it? Is it even New Year's? Huh? It's uh, New Year's Eve. Well, I guess that checks out green. <laughs> We've spoken to her. What's up with you? What up? That's a nice jewel. Oh, you startled me. Yeah. Creeping up so slowly. Yeah. You, you should make a bit of noise when you walk. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that, was, that was a wonderful interaction. <laughs> Let's continue. <laughs> I wonder what's behind these locked doors. Ooh, a crossbow and a gun. Murder weapons. I bet you the murder weapon is going to be a fucking spoon or something. I don't know. You won't believe what the murder weapon is. What is this? <coughs> is it a carrot? <laughs> I guess I, I've already spoken to her, haven't I? Yeah. That's a nice moustache. Look at that moustache. Ah! The special guest! Allow me! I'm Martin Earth! Uh amateur magician and penniless land baron, and part of this evening's entertainment. Mr. Mask is so eager to meet you, he's asked that you personally bring him the puzzle box. It's the prize of the collection. Here's the key to the display case over there. Do be a good sport and write over to him. Why does he sound like Russell Brand so much? Or is that why Russell Brand's playing his character in the new movie? Uh, Possibly. That's a totally different franchise. <laughs> oh, is this not Death on the Nile? <laughs> <laughs> what fucking river are we on then? <laughs> yeah, uh, is this the cabinet? Ah, uh, yes. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Puzzle box. Which one's a puzzle box? They're all boxes. Oh, oh no. Greetings, friends. Thank you all for coming to my ah. little New Year's Eve fate. Professor Xavier. <laughs> Good friend of Martin Earth will entertain you from his incredible illusion. Escape from death. Oh, that's a, it's a magic trick. Take time to meet fellow guests. Each of you has been especially seen. This <laughs> sounds like a <laughs> so dopey. <laughs> I promise you, this New Year's Eve will bring you amazing, even startling surprises. We don't want to be too loud. Grandma over here might have a heart attack. <laughs> 
<laughs> Alright, let's go then. Let's see this fucking illusion is. Illusion. Here. Ah, where is it? There you go. You. There you go. There you go. Thank you. The most interesting sample of this. It's called the Puzzle Box of Death. Now, let me show you how this amazing box works. Nope. No thanks. May I have everyone's attention? When he opens it, he's gonna oh, die. I... <gasps> he's dead! I could have died! The cunt. You could have killed me! He's dead. Oh yeah, no shit, woman. The mystery begins. She's like, he's dead. He's dead. I guess we will look at this box. That box is deadly. Don't touch it. Bitch. It's pretty uh, ironic. A German, a German telling you what to do in the 1930s. <laughs> Satire. <laughs> Not enough there's a fucking Nazi war criminal in the corner drinking wine. <laughs> I think it was him. <laughs> okay. When, who put her in charge, by the way? Nobody move. Detective Ari Bat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a murder. Look at this. Look at this prick. <laughs> What's up with his stance? We're just going go here then. Let's go in here. Oh. I knew something bad was going to happen. Oh, you knew, did ya? You knew. Are you taking him? So do we go in here then? Let's go. <coughs> You there, with the body there. <laughs> What's all he said? Oh, he was fast. That was. F oh, we should check every room. Alright, let's go up here. It's a very, like, the, the detailing on the walls and everything looks very smooth. It's just because it's very poor graphics. Well, I guess it was okay for its time. Yeah. Look, it's locked. Why is it locked? So at, at some point, do I just make a, a suggestion, or do I have to find the clues and shit first? You've got to find the clues. Cause I'm ready to guess right now, because this motherfucker just run off with the body, and he's either locked it in a room with himself, or he's locked it in another room with himself. <laughs> <laughs> this I bitch. Wish I could have watched the guests when Mask died to see who was. Surprised. Okay, well, she's asking the right questions. I want her by my side as my assistant. <laughs> you come forth. Okay, first things first. Kel. <laughs> Why are you here? Let's say that I'm trying to do my travelling outside Germany before 1939. So the year is 1938. We have deduced this. <laughs> you don't ask any other questions. Oh, oh, these questions for her? Yeah. Okay. Do you treat, I mean, know any of the guests here? What's These what? guests? I know nothing about them professionally. I have read of our little Russian friend Popov in secret dossiers. Turns out, she participated in the Soviet ESP experiments. It's a great help in her spying, I'm sure. Yeah. You all have a past, love. <laughs> Let's ask about the puzzle box. <laughs> Do you know anything about the puzzle box? Sorry. You was fucking deadly. You told me to stay back from it. I saw you, other than the fact you were fucking... Taking charge a second ago. Magic, here we go. What do you know about the magic tricks? I can't help you there. Yeah. Okay. Ian Mosk. <laughs> How do you know? Is he the vegetable in the, t <laughs> the wheelchair? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's Professor Xavier. Oh, oh, shit! Okay. Let's find out. Mosk. Didn't know him at all. Though he'd make a classic psychiatric patient, I'm sure he exhibits some unique pathology. Not I never met him until I boarded the ship. 
Oh, he's okay. That's great. That's real great. Kel. Kel and Magic. We've already asked her about both of these. But let's try again. <laughs> Go be thorough. I'm a scientist. But I have seen in people's hearts and minds that the universe is not as simple as we'd like to think. <laughs> Let's talk about the fucking universe. Right, okay, guess some magic. I would think not, but I bet some people, like Green, are pretty good at pretending. Yeah, I tried to find Green Love, but uh, he ran away with the body. <laughs> it's just pretty fucking suspicious. <laughs> ESP. Okay, ESP. Do you know anything about ESP? And. No. No. Brilliant. You're useless. <laughs> Absolutely useless. Let's talk to this bitch at the piano. Yo. Let's have a look at her. Breasts. <laughs> Here we go. What's his name? On the picture. No. A genuine Savata. Do you know about my picture? What they really show? Show me something magical. And I draw just something even more amazing, I draw you the future. Um, can you draw me solving the case? Can you, can you figure that one out, buddy? <laughs> That's brilliant. Don't you threaten me with a good time. There we go, let's have a look. Get away from me, you freak. Ah! Mask is dead, and yet this little party goes on. No, no one's continuing the party. No. What is she talking about? Is she the Soviet? Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's have, a, let's have a look at this. Lovely eye shade. Nice jewels. Well put together. Nice body. Uh, decent tricep game. <laughs> <laughs> let's ask her about this pop all off a lot. Why am I here? Why are you here? Oh. Why is anyone here? Oh, it's the eve one. before the world changes. Forever. She makes a good point. What does she mean forever? What does she mean forever? I think it's an expression. <clears throat> I'm going to write that down in my notebook. Forever. The same. Strangers, every one of them. Dreary, no? But I can guess that this woman's psychiatrist, Kel, is, I imagine, a spy. Okay, okay. I saw you talking to that woman in a bed. Be careful, my friend. Kel is such Kel is the, the, the cardigan. Yeah, the German one. So they're telling each other, telling us that each well, other... Bear in mind, she's from the Soviet Union. And she, and Kel's from the Third Reich. Also, she's a Nazi. Well, she's German. Shit. I don't know if she agrees with the so They are Nazis. Fuck, bro. And I wanted to believe this woman. Who knows? Perhaps Mask heard that I'm a trained hypnotist. Maybe he hoped I'd help him discover some terribly interesting previous life somewhere. I don't know what it is. Maybe later. I figured it out. I'll hypnotize you. You'll hypnotize me, will ya? Here's what you've done, love. <laughs> You've hypnotized him into thinking he's dead. He's not really dead, but you've hypnotized him. <laughs> <laughs> the box was a trigger. <laughs> and you've... This is all a trick. Green was to run off with the body before we discovered that he was really alive. This is all a fake to claim insurance on the boat <laughs> that you've bought and you can't afford. Where do I guess this? <laughs> well, I guess we have to go through the game. Here we go. You tell me more about yes. Better than tell you. Let me show you. Okay. Take off your clothes. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Oh. What is this card? Ace of Spades. <laughs> Square. Mm, that was wrong. 
This bitch. <laughs> Tell me who did it! <laughs> what is this card? Okay, is it, is it a star? Is it a star now? Is it Soviet? Mm, that was wrong. Ah. What is this card? This is why intuition is so shit. How the fuck am I a detective? <laughs> I'm not gonna solve this case. <laughs> Maybe guess what this fucking card is? That was wrong. Oh my god, five out of five. Well, the only one I have against is this card. Wait, it could be the same ones repeated. Oh, fuck it up. Mm, that was wrong. Is there no way for me to bypass this whole bullshit? Well, it doesn't appear that you have ESP. Too bad. I don't either. But oh. here. Take the cards. You've wasted my time. You can pass the time until the main event. You've wasted my time. You think there's going to be a main event? The host is dead <laughs> now. Let's move on for that one. What do you, who do you think might have ESP? The old guy, since you can draw my fucking future. to score higher. And the psychic power is usually stronger with someone who is young. Young? This guy, why did you tell me to get the mystery box? You're in a lot of trouble, mister. <laughs> you balked me. I, I, I didn't know that box was deadly. Oh yeah, I believe him. You do believe me, don't you? Yep, I believe you, buddy. Yes, I believe you. Let's go, let's find someone else. It's not him, it's too obvious. This guy, on the other hand, he hasn't moved. He hasn't moved. Since Mask should have known better. Chinese puzzle boxes are always booby trapped. Hmm. You think it's a booby trap? Okay. Let's have a quick look. Why are you here? Why the amazing collection on this ship? Strange lot, don't you think? Nearly every object here is connected to the Egyptian cult of the Netherworld. The so-called death cult of Egypt. Look at this distinguished gentleman. Look at the way he is sitting. Yes, very distinguished. Mm-hmm, I see, I see. Mask seems to have a one-track mind. Guests. How do you know the guests? Tell me the answers, man. <laughs> I don't know anything about that. Uh, I don't know anything about that. <laughs> oh, you don't know anything. No one seems to know anything. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have nothing to say about that. You're a fucking historian, you prick. You're here for the collection. You know you know what's going on. It's him. <laughs> it's him and the green lady. In cahoots. Sorry, I have no answer for you. Yeah. You know about death cults? Or what do you know about Ian Mosk? <laughs> Mosk? Nothing, except he's a collector. Oh. Incredibly wealthy, yes. it must be an amazing eccentric to build a castle on top of a mountain. Castle. I'm hoping he'll fund my expedition to the Gobi Desert. Not anymore, mate. He's fucking dead, if you haven't noticed. ESP. <laughs> I'm hoping he'll fund my expedition. ESP? ESP? That psychic stuff? Extrasensory perception? A waste of my time. No, thank you. He's arrogant. He's hateful. <laughs> so it's not him. Only this, my friend. I told Mask it was an amazing box that throughout history had been used to hide secrets. Uh -huh. Deadly secrets. You've lied to me. You said you didn't know anything about the box. And now you've just told me it's used to hide deadly secrets throughout history. So he knows the history of the box, and he knows what it was used for. Excellent. Plum, you've Every done your Every artifact here was discovered by Sir Alexander Black, oh. an amazing explorer. I knew him from his museum exhibits. Ah. He was an amateur Egyptologist, but he made some incredible finds. Then, of course, he died with his wife in a tragic plane crash. Ah, it was in all the papers. That was a matter as well, wasn't he it? He was survived by a son, who apparently vanished. The son. Who is the son? Who is the son? Well, perhaps. I've seen similar items, of course, in the Cairo Museum. 
not on display. They were considered too disturbing, since some say the cult of the netherworld is still strong. Give it a rest, will you, love? Last question. That we could get away from this creep. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know about the original discoverer, don't you? No! Alexander Black and his wife died in a suspicious plane accident. Tell me, how did Mask get all this stuff? Can you tell me that? I know exactly what happened. Mask killed whoever the son is, his parents, to get all the artifacts. Okay? In a plane crash. The son survived. Whoever the son is, is the murderer. Because the son wants to kill Mask to get revenge for his family. That's an interesting hypothesis. Yes. There we go. Problem solved. Let's go. That's a nice map. What up, bruh? Bad business. Yeah. We better get off this ship. Well, yeah. Well, we're in the middle of the River Nile, mate. <laughs> So we're going to have to ask you some questions, all right, Mr. Ketchup? <laughs> oh, I'm just a good German military man uh, who did my duty when the time came. How many Jews did you kill? How many Jews did you kill? I don't think he's German. He is German. He just said German military man. I think he said journeyman. Journeyman, okay. So he said, okay, he either said German or journeyman. The blood of Christ. I don't think the Holocaust happened at this point. It's 1939. Oh, shit. <laughs> Where were the start? We're just getting warmed up. <laughs> Why not? Who knows what this lot would want from Mars, dead or alive? We know what he wants. The exhibition. Puzzle box. Let's go. Hi, yes. I picked it up just like you and nothing happened. Interesting, isn't it? So you're too Do dense to solve the puzzle. It? We don't need two corpses. You didn't fucking solve it, you just picked it up. Just this. A trick gone wrong can kill. I'd advise you to be very careful. Mm. Master and magic. Yes. I've never admitted to any soldiers under my command. But I know that the ancient cultures hide strange secrets. Oh, I doubt that. All this magic rubbish is probably a cover for something else Mask really wanted. What did Mask want? Okay. What did he want? Okay. Now we've spoken to everyone up here, except this creep in the wheelchair, which I don't really want to speak to him. Isn't this the year that the war's going to start? I think so, yeah. Yeah, so she's gonna vote for Hitler. Talk to me, woman. You, you brought back that box. The deadly box that killed him. You are trying to blame people. It is you. What is this? Have you got the ESPN? Scarlet. I don't think I have anything to do with this. I don't know what to think. You killed him. Martin Earth is the heir to the blessed kid fortune of Bloodworth Estates. There's no money left now, so he performs elaborate magic illusions for the enjoyment of Mask and his well held friends. He told me about you. I guess you know him? As for the rest of them? The magician is the son. The magician is the son! That's why he's learned magic, he's an amateur magician. Nothing. Okay, okay, we got it. Like magic? Woman? <laughs> no. No. Yes. Yes. I love it. All I know is that he invited us to a New Year's Eve party on an isolated mountain peak. And you went, and you came. Weird. You're young. Go ahead. But I can tell you, I do not have you. You're gonna have ESP. Watch. This brother's gonna have ESP. Star. Yeah, this has got ESP. Well done, woman. Circle. Yep. Just keep pressing star. 
star. Ah, did you do that? Wavy line. Ah, oh, you're a bit shit, aren't you, love? Square. Oh, she's got ESP. You may have ESP. Brilliant. I can see three numbers of today's date. What does it mean? Fuck. 31st of the 12th, 1939. So 31, 12, 39. Okay, that's the code. Um, let's go. It's going to be a bit of a fuck on getting it open. Bro, don't you let me deal with this. I am amazing with saves. One of the players is now ordering food. <laughs> Not fried chicken, you racist. Or curry. Not this time. Not this time. Okay. 31. 12. A few moments later. You're a fucking cunt. I hate this game. One hour later. Oh. Well. Oh, you fucker! Oh. One eternity later. As I'm, I'm assuming this is the the right ting. <laughs> it is the right ting, bro. Yeah, thirty-one. Well, that doesn't fuck. Just try it. Just try it. Right, that's it. That's part one. Tune in next time for when we get this fucking door open.